So I'm no salary cap expert. I'm still trying to figure all this out. Rodney McLeod restructures his contract, reworks his contract. And, you know, it was known that if he wasn't willing to take a pay cut, he probably wasn't going to be back. And we found out today that the Eagles indeed reworked his contract. Details of that contract are unknown. And I'm trying to figure out the reason for that, which I believe is because it's not the start of the league, new league year yet. And ultimately the question I have here is because the, the other move or the other, the other uh, newsworthy item or thing that happened today was the rollover money uh, for the salary cap. So the Eagles are about like 15 million over the salary cap for right now. And, and this is important if, you know, they, they want to go this Nick Foles tag and trade route um, because you have to shed a lot of salary. And that's the question I have is I don't know if this restructure allows them to save that cap right now immediately. I think they may have to wait until the new league year starts. Um, I'm, I'm not 100% positive about that. You know, I could be wrong uh, if, if, you know, somebody wants to prove me wrong, um, you know, please, you know, with an article or something. But as of right now, I, I think the rollover money counts. I, th- I think they're now on the 9 million mark, if, if I am correct about that. But I'm not sure about the McLeod thing. So that I, I'm sure we will get further details and I, I will figure this out. Um, I was texting Brendan and, you know, we, we're kind of like, I, I guess they're just not allowed to say what they are until the new league year starts. I mean, that's kind of what we assume. So I guess you can re- rework deals, but I guess you can't officially announce it, what those details are until the league year starts, if, if that's correct. Um, so we'll, we'll see about that. That's, that's because uh, McLeod was scheduled to be a $9.9 million cap hit, and you would have saved $5 million if you cut him. Uh, because he was a $4.8 million dead cap, I believe. So, um, you know, again, details are unknown, but, you know, again, announced by the Eagles on their website. So uh, there's the news on Rodney McLeod. He's going to be back uh, for the Eagles uh, next season. Now, the other thing about this is, you know, the the Eagles had some guys emerge uh, because of his injury. Guys like Avante Maddox, there's, you know, questions like, are the Eagles going to move Jalen Mills to safety? Are they going to move Rasul Douglas to safety? Well, now if you're bringing bringing Rodney McLeod back, now you just got, you know, more increased versatility because you know he's going to be your single high safety. And, you know, with other guys, you can kind of like experiment with some things. If you, you can mix and match, you know, play cornerback and safety, play hybrid roles if you want to. You know, we'll, we'll see what kind of stuff uh, this, this defense comes up with next season. But this is the Rodney McLeod contract situation and the details as of right now. He has reworked his deal. He has taken a pay cut, and we don't know what the details of that pay cut are at the time, at, at, at right now. Whatever. It's 1130. God bless me. Take care. Peace.